what's up y'all welcome back to my channel for those of you that do not know me my name is Mara so in today's video I'm gonna show you guys my curly hair routine on my days off because if you got curly hair if you got natural hair you know that this is anything but a short process wash day styling it takes about a whole decade to get through so that's what I'm gonna be showing you guys today in this video if you haven't done so already please be sure to hit that subscribe button down below with the bell so you're notified with every video I upload so for my styling today, I actually did something a little bit different. I've actually done this a few times in the past. I deep conditioned my hair with a steamer. Yes, the products that you've seen, the Aussie Moist Shampoo and Conditioner, those are the products that I cleanse my hair with. And then the Cream of Nature Hair Mask, which I absolutely love the smell. For this particular method, I actually just left the deep conditioner in my hair while I steamed and then I did leave it in after. So I just pretty much applied the gel on top, which you guys did see that I showed you two gels instead of the pink, which has a hold of eight. <laughs> that smells like a car wash. I absolutely love it. I actually went with the Black Jamaican Castor Oil by Eco Style because that actually has a hold of ten. I'm not going to lie, the pink Eco Style definitely does give me the hold that I need. However, I need something a little bit heavier um, and a little bit firmer to hold my curls in place. Um, so with the pink eagle style, I believe I can go about two to three days without me losing definition as opposed to when I did it with the black Jamaican castor oil gel, which has a hold of 10. Again, I went about four to five days. So there's definitely that little difference in between the two, di two different, <laughs> what the two different gels that you use. One is obviously going to have a firmer hold and therefore you're going to have a hairstyle that lasts a little bit longer. So honestly, this way um, is great for those who have dehydrated hair. I don't even know if that's the word, dehydrated or just dry hair. Okay, we're going to go dry. Um, so for those who have dry hair like me, it's really good to steam your hair just because it opens up your hair cuticles and it gets that moisture in and it traps that moisture in once the steaming process is done. So using a moisturizing conditioner along with the steaming, it really does do the benefits. So this is my hair after I applied all of the product and after I've scrunched the front to get the curls a little bit more defined and in formation. But we're going to take a real quick pause because this is embarrassing. Why? Why am I like this? Um, but this is my hair. Again, you can see it's really defined. Again, it's still wet. But to get a little bit more definition and a little bit more volume, what we're going to do, we're going to flip our hair just so that way our hair is not flat at the roots and then we're gonna put it in a bun now i know a lot of you are probably thinking well don't you lose definition because your hair in the back it's being stretched to be pulled in a bun you're not losing definition actually you're gaining a little bit more length but your hair is still going to be very much defined and you guys will see that when i take it down and i've honestly probably never would have thought to put my hair in a bun while it was wet to get more definition for myself because I personally just like when my hair is a little bit flatter to start off day one or day two and then it gets bigger over time because guaranteed the second day my hair is always bigger but this is how my hair came out just by leaving it in a bun and I actually went to work and I came back and then I filmed this because my hair was still wet when I woke up so I just let it air dry but again if you're one of those that struggle with definition and or length if you have a lot of shrinkage this bun and this method is definitely good for you because your hair is moisturized even though my hair looks dead dry it's really not it's moisturized that's just really the color of my hair I'm sorry but my hair is not dry it's not flaking up it's not dusty crusty or dry <laughs> I don't know what else to say but I do hope you guys like this video. I do hope you found it helpful. And I do hope you try the deep conditioning steaming. I don't know why I'm laughing. I do hope you try the deep conditioning steaming method on your hair. Do not forget to give this video a thumbs up. And make sure you subscribe. And also share it with your friends if they are natural and curly as well. I will see you guys in my next video. And I do hope you enjoy the rest of your weekend. Bye.